First thing we need to do is import libraries. The libraries Dallas temperature and one wire. The next thing we need to do uh, is create instances of the one wire and the Dallas temperature classes. So we do the one wire one and we know it could be any IO pin we could use. And then we need to instantiate the Dallas temperature class. So we need to pass one wire. Uh, then we can begin the normal Arduino programming. So we'll have a, a setup. And the only thing we need to do in setup at the moment is initialize the sensors. Sensors dot begin. And of course we need a loop. The next thing we need to do is actually do something with our temperature sensor. So I'll get rid of that line. And the first thing we need to do is request the temperatures. Which is done with this line of code. This doesn't actually return anything. It just sets up the data in a buffer ready for us to read. So I'm now going to create uh, a very temp. I'm going to fill in with the temperature. And you do this with another command, which looks like this. And this will go and get the temperature in degrees centigrade for sensor number zero. Now, if you remember, you can have multiple DS18B20 devices connected together uh, in a daisy chain. Now all I need to do is return that data back up the serial port so that we can see it. If we try and compile this, and that compiles, and we'll push it up to the Arduino. And we'll open up the serial port monitor and see what we've got. 